Hi guys, today I'm doing a quick video on how to block certain websites in Windows. So if you don't want your kids or your employees visiting certain websites but you don't want to mess with your network settings, this is a great way to block any website on any browser on any workstation. So just keep watching, I'll show you quick easy steps on how to modify the Windows host file. So first I log into my Windows 10 machine. You do have to have administrator rights to the computer to be able to do this change. We're going to go to All Applications, and we want to run Notepad, but not just run Notepad, but specifically run Notepad as Administrator. So if you go to Notepad, right-click, and then select Run as Administrator, then it will start up Notepad with the admin access, saving, being able to save files and modify files that you normally would not have permissions to. Next, we're going to go ahead and open up the host file. So this is located in C Drive, Windows, System32, Drivers, ETC, Host. So the path is right here on the screen. It'll also be in the notes below. So we're just going to browse to that directory. Now, by default, Notepad will only show you files with .ext extension. So you want to make sure you go ahead and change that to all files because the host file does not have an extension. So this is what it looks like initially. And if you notice, there's a lot of entries here, but they all start out with a pound symbol, which means they're commented out. They actually have no uh, modifications to the system. They're making no changes to the way the system resolves IP addresses and host names. So we're going to add our own entry in here. So we're going to put in 0, .0, 0.0.0.0, which is no IP address. There's nothing going to route to that. So by doing that and then putting in the host name Facebook, we're essentially going to block um, the host resolution to that IP address. So now Facebook is going to point to a non-existent IP address that we cannot reach. So first we put in our void IP address, 0.0.0.0 .0 is a good one. And then we're going to put in the domain name, the host name that we want to block. And in this case, it's www.facebook.com. So this is what we want to block. So by doing this, when someone tries to access Facebook, it's going to say the IP address is 0.0.0.0, which is a non-existent IP address, which essentially means it cannot send traffic there and nothing will happen. Like it won't load the page, but not just say it won't load the page on like uh, Edge or Internet Explorer or Chrome. It's pretty much all browsers, anything, any sort of chat service, it will not work. So if you go to facebook.com, it won't work. If you search for Facebook, it'll come up with Facebook, but if you click on it, again, it will not work. So this is just a quick way of blocking any site that you want to prevent either users or your kids from accessing from their Windows workstation. And this works on Windows 7, Windows 10, Windows XP. So this modification will work on any of those platforms. Thanks for watching, guys. I hope this was helpful. Have any questions or comments, leave below. Otherwise, subscribe to get updates, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.